What's up sneaker fam? Nick's Kicks here. We're back with another video. Um, we got an unboxing as you can see. Um, the box has been unboxed. But, oh there's nothing in it. Oh. <laughs> Let's get rid of this. Let's get down to business. So, what it looks like, it's Adidas, right? Well, yeah, because it is. Um, nothing else, um, you know. I like my Adidas stuff. They do a good job, especially with their... Boop, boop. Especially with their Originals brand, they did a really good job, and they keep doing a good job with it. Um, it's been around for a long time. It's going to stick around for a long time. Um, these we're going to save for later, because this is the heat. This is the heat in the box. It might burn through the box soon. All right, so we picked up some, some shirts and some crew necks because, you know, winter in Canada is coming. Um, it's pretty cold here. Yeah, that's why. I don't know why my glasses are like that, but that's how they are. Um, so first shirt we got, it's a t-shirt. As you can see, it's that Adidas Tongue. I believe this one's called the Tongue Lab. Um, what they did was they did a collaboration with of all the tongues that Adidas has had, their logos over the years with the Originals brand, and they decided to put it on the front and the back. I mean, it looks amazing. First thing I thought of when I first saw this was complete 90s. I mean, really nostalgic. I think it's an awesome shirt. So that's pickup number one of this unboxing from Adidas. Pickup number two, it's a crew neck. Really soft and comfortable. This is part of the same line, that Tongue Lab collab. Got all the different tongues on it with all the different Adidas. Famous, you know, Tongues that they've had, you know, the Adidas Americana, the classic ones, you got the Stan Smith there, the brand with the three stripes, of course, got some really nice, really nice colors on this crew neck. I thought it came out really nice. So that's number two. Number three now, we're going to go towards soccer, or in Europe, it's called football. So, story behind these guys is that they're part of the Adidas um, ID Dassler line which is their soccer line the man who founded Adidas it has the tag in here hold on let me just show you that there you go whoop, whoop, whoop. you got that Adi Dossler right there then you got the back where it says company founded in 1949 Germany so this one this this shirt goes all the way back to 1974 at least that's what it says on the back this is to commemorate Franz Beckenbauer, one of the best, if not the best, German player of all time. This is jersey, supposedly, because back then they weren't anything special like they are today. So you guys, number five on the back, the year 1974, and he was the captain of Germany. So they have that captain's band. Hold on, let me just get this right there. It looks really nice. It's soft, that's for sure. It's simple. It's soft. Deutsche Football Bund, very, very nice, nice way to commemorate one of the best players of all time. I mean, he's definitely up there, so that one is number three. Number four, now this shirt here goes back to 1990, Germany. It's to commemorate one of their jerseys they have with a crazy design like this on the front. You got that German football, football insignia, you got the Adidas classic that they had on the jersey. And they had this crazy color style, like it's a German flag across the front. I mean, they got it throughout, on, even on the sleeves too. Both sleeves, really nice. Then, of course, they got that 19, 1990, which is the tournament they wore it in. I believe in 1990 was, uh, I think it was a Euro Cup. I mean, I could be wrong. Don't roast me on that, though, in the comments section below, guys. Be nice. You know, I'm still fairly new to this. And now we're going to get into the heat stuff, the stuff you've been waiting for. The sneakers, the sneaker sneakers, um, definitely, definitely some fire here, um, classic, probably one of my favorite Adidas silhouettes, no offense to Yeezy, I mean, but these for me, they just do it, doesn't matter what colorway it's in, whenever I think of these I want to get them in every color and any color they come with, anyway enough talking, as you can see here, I'm going to close that and tease you guys a little bit, there we go, got that Stan Smith. Size 10, flat black, it looks gorgeous, 
It's got that tongue lab, that's what it's a part of, that tongue lab collab with all the different tongues. I mean, you got that Stan Smith, hopefully you can see it on here. Stan Smith face right there with all the different logos on the tongue. Simple black laces, you know, you got that leather upper, white sole, really clean. Um, even on the inside, they went a little above and beyond. Even on the inside of the tongue, they gave it the color, and even the soles. Soles look beautiful, you know what, let me, let me show you guys what they really look like. That. Now that is attention to detail. One thing Adidas has always done, as far as I'm concerned, especially with the Stan Smith, really the shoe is tested, like, tested time, I mean, design-wise, it's so simple, but, you know, whether they get Raph Simons to do a collab, um, you know, they do all kinds of different collabs, whether, even that Horween leather one they did, really wish I could find that one, I can't. So that's one, here's two, you know, flat black and white, man, you can't go wrong. Can't go wrong. Never, never, never go wrong with that. Simple, but it's a little outside of the box because, you know, because you got to be daring, man. You got to be like Yeezy. You got to go a little above and beyond, man, because it's the crazy ones that do well. I don't even know. That doesn't even make sense. I'm just rambling on right now. And here's a second Adidas Stan Smith. This is the other one that's part of the tongue collab. As you can see, they put all the different tongues on the shoe. This one's not leather though. This one feels like it's a kind of like a mesh, meshy kind of nylon that they got on the on the ZX Flux. It's really soft though, really soft. Um, you got that Stan Smith all in black there, really clean. That's one with that white bottom, black, black insoles, that classic black, flat black with a white hit there. Really nice. Then we got the second one, same thing. Really clean shoe. I'm really happy how these came out. I mean, they're a little wild, but you know what? I ain't got no problem being a little wild when it comes to style and looking good. Because you know what? At the end of the day, if you feel like you look good, you know you look good. Eh, that's all that matters to me, at least. I mean, sometimes you gotta rock it. I mean, you gotta look at some of the shoes that people have been wearing lately, and it's just like, how the hell? Do you wear those? Like, if you look at the Supreme Foams, for instance, I mean, that's a crazy shoe in itself. It's on, I, probably on a different level compared to these, but that's a loud shoe, man. When you're wearing this, I mean, okay, it's a little loud, but I'd rather wear these than those foams. I mean, more comfortable, I think, and I can, this is more versatile, I think. I mean, I could probably wear this with a suit, all black suit. You know, you go with a white shirt, multicolored tie. Man, you'd be pimping with that. Big pimping, man. But I mean, can't go wrong. My favorite silhouette from Adidas, Stan Smiths. The next ones I'm trying to get are those US Open ones that came out in the summer. The, you know, they're all white and then they got that orange on the back with that tennis ball feeling. So hopefully those, I will be able to cop and have them in my collection soon. As you can see, we had a very successful unboxing from Adidas. Adidas Originals always makes good quality. Anyway, I'm going to cut it short now because I'm starting to ramble. Anyway, guys, that's it for Nick's Kicks this week. Well, not this week, but it's been a while. Hopefully, I'll be up with some more content soon. Just been really busy lately. Um, if you like this video, give it a good thumbs up. It goes a long way. If you want to see any other, anything else in upcoming videos, leave comments down below. Um, subscribe to the channel if you like the video. And hopefully, I'll see you guys soon. Till then, sneaker fam, peace.